So let's talk about the big Kate Middleton update and news. In January, I underwent major abdominal surgery in London. And at the time, it was thought that my condition was non-cancerous. The surgery was successful. However, tests after the operation found cancer had been present. You know, this announcement comes as a shock for several reasons. One, because of course it's just terrible for her personally, as well as the royal family with King Charles disclosing his own cancer diagnosis last month. And two, because for weeks the internet had collectively pulled its hair out trying to figure out what the hell was going on with Kate Middleton. And so like we talked about, people on social media just churned out every conspiracy theory under the sun. But as for the people who aren't staying in conspiracy land, there's been two main reactions to this news. First, you had many people blasting internet speculators for hounding a woman who was clearly going through something personal. But then also we saw the second type of reaction Action, which points the blame not at social media, but at the royal family, arguing that they allowed conspiracy theories to flourish and even egg them on by completely bungling this whole thing for two months, including seemingly putting even more pressure on Kate by blaming her for creating that photoshopped image. But follow to stay in the loop. 